What's up everybody, it's the Untouchable Wolf, aka the fierce competitor, the wolf that never sleeps. Hope y'all are doing good and today we have a very special video. But first let me know in the comment section below, what is your favorite map in the game so far? So far mine is white out, but I do like the map right here that I'm on Tremor. So let me know your thoughts and I hope y'all are doing good. Today we be talking about releasing your demons, as well as me talking about the two guns, the Remington R5 and the submachine gun, the K7. Usually when I do best gun topics, I talk about, oh man, I gotta place this sentry gun very nicely right there. But, uh, <laughs> it's pretty funny. But actually, I usually talk about assault rifles versus assault rifles, but now I'm be talking about uh, assault rifles versus submachine guns and which ones uh, should you use. Because a lot of people are saying the maps are so big, but you still can rush around. And you just have to play extra smart when we're talking about using a submachine gun. And a K7 is a very nice, it reminds me of the UMP from MW3. So I was playing this game, I was like, I wanted to just think to myself, I'm using a UMP, but it's the K7, so it's a really good gun. The Remington R5 is a really good uh, gun, too. I'm going to give you stats for both of the guns really quick, and then we'll get into the main topic about releasing your demons. So the stats for uh, the Remington R5, the damage is 49 up close, 20 at long range. The magazine size is at 30. The rate of fire is 638, and the recoil is very low. But uh, since the rate of fire is kind of slow, you might have those... Uh, Problems in close quarter combat, that's why I do recommend using the AK-12, which I think is the best assault rifle so far in the game. I'm really enjoying it, so I might change my mind when I use other guns more frequently, but the AK-12 right now is the hands-on, the best gun so far. So when you're talking about the K-7 stats, the damage is 34 up close to 15 at long range, but it still does uh, pretty good. Uh, you can get some kills long range. The magazine is 32 rounds, and the rate of fire is 895. So uh, you can see right there, it does a lot of damage up close in those close quarter combat. Now let's talk about releasing your demons. Man, so we're, when we're talking about releasing your demons, it's all about, do you have, I'm asking I'm ask you the question, do you have all this uh, rage built inside of you from Black Ops 2, or maybe even from MW3? It's time to let that go. This is a new Call of Duty game, and I truly do love it. I wouldn't lie to you. I'm always honest. I'm having a lot of fun with this game. It's truly awesome. I know a lot of people are like, Untouchable Wolf, the maps are so big and you die so fast. I know uh, people, some, some people just have very short memories. Because I remember people were complaining about Black Ops 2 saying the maps were so small. So now that we have bigger maps, they're saying the maps are so big. So, But if you just give this game a chance, once you learn the maps, you're going to be okay. Once you learn how to use the guns effectively, you're not going to be uh, complaining too much about how fast you die. Because I believe this is kind of a Call of Duty Ghost Battlefield uh, battlefield kind of feel to it because I have uh, played lots of Battlefield and you die uh, quickly in Battlefield 2 but uh, this is Call of Duty Ghost and I really do enjoy it and I have to say also make sure to check out the campaign if you haven't tried it out I promise you if you haven't tried it out because I know many of you have been going straight to the multiplayer but if you try out that campaign and you're gonna be hooked at the very beginning of the opening scene it's classic so let me know in this comment section below if you have tried the campaign out right there, you see I was uh, completing a field order. Man, I was getting IMS for days. So to release your demons, you have to ask yourself, uh, like I said, uh, are you still frustrated from previous Call of Duties about the Black Ops 2 uh, hit detection? Uh, you kill, you get a, you can kill right on in this game. So I really do like that as the hit detection is right on. And I really enjoyed uh, these guns, the new guns, as well as the new game modes and the maps. So, uh, and also that they brought in the KM Strike is really cool. And it actually, sometimes it changes the face of the maps. So guys, let me know your thoughts about Ghost and release those demons and you can become a really good player. Don't worry about the past. Don't worry about what's in front of you. Make sure to click on that like button if you enjoy the more videos be coming soon. Alright, take care. Later. Peace.